Let the rhyme style games begin. What is going on my super sandwiches? Rhyme style here and today I want to get some energy from you guys. Send me your energy. And by energy, I mean feedback for a couple things that I want to basically see, uh, I guess, your opinions on about the content I put out. So first things first, random battles. Now, I know you guys like random battles. Uh, you watch them, you guys leave the likes, uh, you guys leave the feedback, comments, and all that stuff. So I know you guys enjoy the random battles. So they will not be going away anytime soon. I'm going to keep doing them every now and then randomly uh, with other YouTubers and random people like you guys, subscribers and stuff like that. So expect more random battles over the next couple weeks, couple months, whatever, up until we get Xenoverse 2. Uh, but the question I want to ask is, is what will make random battles a lot more enjoyable? Now, I always get feedback that's like, hey, fight Thundershy, fight Kagi, fight Afro. I fight those people. That's... I mean, it's feedback, but it's not really new feedback. So if there's anything that I can do to make the random battles different, maybe play my custom character character again or something, uh, maybe we can even randomize moves with our custom character characters to, to make it a little bit more, I guess, uh, randomized or special, I guess, whatever. Any kind of feedback to make the random battles more enjoyable, uh, this is your chance to basically speak out now, and then based on what you guys say, I might change the random battles around, or I might just keep doing the same thing where I just do, uh, you know, close my eyes, a butt mash triangle, and get whoever I get. And just, you know, do fights like that. Basically, that's how you've been seeing the past couple months. But if there's something that can make it more better, more fun, let me know. Now, I will address this now because I know people are going to ask me for, to do 2v2s and 3v3s. I most likely will not do 2v2s and 3v3s for two reasons, really. One, because 2v2s and 3v3s, they tend to lag a lot. And two, uh, having four people or six people in one chat, it can get very chaotic. Uh, and if you have a bunch of voices yelling back and forth, it'll be unorganized, it'll be tough to really hear what's going on. And that's mostly why I'm doing 2v2s and 3v3s, even when the connection is good. So if I get, like, let's say me, Afro, Thundershot, Kag it together into one chat, well, it could be pretty fun. It could also just be all us yelling at the same time, and it might not be the most enjoyable video to really listen to. But then again, that's just my own opinion. For all I know, it could be a lot of fun. But from my past opinion, uh, or from my past experience with random battles, uh, They've just been kind of tough to kind of understand just because everybody's kind of yelling. So that's why I don't really do 2v2s and 3v3s. So I'm mostly going to do 1v1s uh, with YouTubers or like I said, you guys like I do with the random battles with subscribers and stuff like that. But anything else that can make the random battles a lot more fun, uh, this is your chance to basically, you know, speak out now by leaving a comment below. And I'm going to read every single comment. So literally, like, let me have it. Like, send me as much energy as possible. And uh, based on what people want, I will basically, you know, make them more fun or just keep doing the same thing. I don't know. Um... Other Dragon Ball Z games, I do want to play more. Uh, I've been talking about playing Raging Blast, for example, with like Toasty, maybe Danny or somebody. I might do that again, too. So if you guys want to see all the Dragon Ball Z games as well, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. But this is mostly about uh, Xenoverse for now, because I know Xenoverse are the ones uh, that you guys tend to enjoy the most as of right now, just based off of analytics and, you know, seeing how you guys respond to Xenoverse battles. So let me have it. Let me know your thoughts there. Now, the second thing I want to talk about is Dragon Ball Xenoverse campaign mode. Now, I know the game came out almost a year ago now. It is currently November. The game came out in February. And uh, why is campaign mode even being brought up? Well, mostly because I never actually finished campaign mode when the game came out. I kind of wanted to, you know, play the game myself and kind of wait for you guys to play the game first before I start making the Let's Play and spoiling it. So then I started my campaign, I think, around the summertime, but I never finished it. Uh, it wasn't really that popular, so that's why I kind of stopped doing it as well. But I did want to kind of finish it up. So my, you know, my theory or my, uh, I guess idea I want to toss out to you guys is what if I actually redo uh, the campaign mode since I never finished it in the first place on my second channel my the rhyme style games channel which is linked in the description below subscribe to that if you haven't yet because I do a bunch of let's plays there I play Grand Theft Auto with the squad and other people I play Fallout I play pretty much any other game that's not anime related on that channel but it's kind of funny because this will be anime related but it's mostly a, a let's play channel and then anything else that's what that channel is for but I would do I would really be interesting um, I'll be really interested to basically play Xenoverse once again if you guys want it. So, again, leave a like below or feedback uh, if you guys want that. And then on my second gaming channel sometime in the next, I guess, week or so, I will probably start a Xenoverse Let's Play from the start. I will create a new character and everything. You guys can even help me pick the race as well. Uh, and if you guys want that, I will do a Xenoverse playthrough on that channel from start to finish uh, since I never finished it. So... What do you guys think about that? Would that be redundant? Would it be, you know, would it be kind of lame because it's already done so many times? I guess this is your chance to kind of speak out on that as well. So, uh, again, to kind of cover the two things I want to know is how can Z uh, Xenoverse Random Battles be more fun? And two, would a Let's Play on my second channel, The Random Style Games, be even interesting? Um, so let me know your thoughts on both of those in the comment section below. And, of course, if you have not subscribed to The Random Style Games, what are you doing? Look at Cell. This is Cell right here talking. See? 
That was Cell. Cell said, uh, let the Marasa games begin. Actually, that's, that's Kagi voicing Cell. So big shout out to Kagi for doing an awesome Cell impression. Uh, but yeah, I do other games over there. I've been playing, you know, with various YouTubers. Uh, you know, I'm playing single player stuff like Fallout as well. Uh, Dragon Quest. I actually finished my Naruto Ninja Storm 3 Let's Play on that channel to those who haven't really realized that yet. Uh, but that's completely finished. So you can watch that entire thing over there as well. So go over there. Check that channel out. This is kind of also a video to kind of promote that second channel that I started, uh, what, two months ago now? So if you're interested in more content, I tend to upload it at least once a day up there. Uh, that's kind of like my goal right now. So if you want something else, something non-anime related, or I guess kind of anime related, because we are, I do Naruto and Dragon Ball over there as well, uh, kind of. Uh, you can go to that channel as well, so yeah. Anyway, so I just want to kind of toss this video out there as, as a bonus one, as a third video for today, just to get the feedback. So let me know what you're thinking, your thoughts, and all the good stuff, and I guess we'll just take it from there. As always, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. My name is Ramstyle, and I'll see all you awesome Super Saiyans in the comment section below. Peace!